feel if someone took your daughter hostage when you just got her back? What does that mean? I mean, is he, is he trying to imply that someone's being held hostage or she has been held hostage? Come on now. I mean, anything's possible. But why say it? Now, sure, uh, Voices Behind the Wall has tried to get to the bottom of this and she's put some uh, text messages on, uh, on her community tab and he said, it's edited, it's spliced together. No, it isn't, Don. No, it isn't. I do a lot of video editing and I know that that call at that point was not spliced together. You said it. And, you know, his supporters are... are <sighs> are going always, always till someday they are, trying to, I don't know, is it damage control? Is it just putting in some reasonable doubt into the case, thinking, you know, when Don and Candice and maybe even Grandma, I'll come on to her in my next video. If they're arrested and this thing ends up at trial, are they testing out all the different possibilities of what people will believe in relation to reasonable doubt, bringing in reasonable doubt in the case. Are they that clever? Is, uh, is the Wells new management team, whoever they are, that clever? They've told him to stay off social media. Well, he hasn't done. I mean, I know these calls to Ziggy were made in November, but, you know, the other night when... Uh, Andrew called him. He was more than happy to talk. He was more than happy to name names. In a the implication that Don made was not to Ziggy's daughter. It was to his own daughter. Even Michelle Walks said it. Michelle after dark. She said the same thing that Don said that. And Michelle ain't wrong. I heard this on Ziggy's channel, but I knew I had seen it on Michelle after dark. Channel 2 and Michelle is right because y'all know top tier ain't wrong.